Hello everyone, Sigma Later here. Welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition. Sorry, Grant. Right, we've got some missions to do. See that special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. Fixing something if you can't hunt. It was a special bid on the Citadel. Got some loyalty missions to sort out, so let's go get these done. Shut up. Turn back, human. I may be an ambassador among my people, but that doesn't mean I have to speak to the likes of you. Don't think that carrying this wealth of a croaking makes you worth my time. Leave now before my guards decide to reject you. You seem like a well-traveled croaking ambassador. I am. Then you must know who I am. And you have to be aware that bad things happen to those who oppose me. Stand down, men. I'm starting to like this human. I am the ambassador to Erdnok from Clan Nakmor. We're a small clan based in Akratic Wastes. If Nakmor is a small clan, how do you keep the more powerful clans from destroying you? We are the clan of the great warlord Nakmor Kral, who faced down platoons of Turians and won. Most clans lend us the respect our ancestor is due. What business does Clan Nakmor have with the Erdnot? Clan leader Rex requested that I come. He and Clan Nakmor have been in talks about a more permanent alliance. With our help, Erdnot could rally others behind its banner and truly unite Tuchanka, and we would gain the chance to fight in larger battles with greater plunder. I thought all Krogan want to be warriors. What makes a Krogan become an ambassador? <sighs> You don't know as much as you think, human. A Krogan diplomat has to represent the strength of his people, or his clan appears ripe for conquest. I slaughtered my way to the top of my clan, human. I speak with the authority of a warrior. Fair enough. I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. I am, actually. Ooh. Watch it. That's up. Go away. Clans doesn't have to listen to aliens. Alright, fair enough. Oh god, out the way. You go beyond yourself, Gatatag Uvank. The rights of Erdnot are dominant. How do we know it will challenge him? He's unnatural. The beasts of the right could ignore him like a lump of plastic. They know blood no matter the womb. Your barking does not help your case. I'll speak for myself. This is the tank bread. It is very lifelike. Smells correct as well. Your protests ring hollow, Uvank. I don't care what this idiot says. Grunt has the right to be here. There's some fire. And from an alien. Oh, the shame this heaps on those who whine like pups. <laughs> this must stand on ritual that I invoke a denial. My Krantz stands against him. He has no one. <sighs> My patience is tested, but Uvank invokes correctly. Grunt, who is your craft? Your allies willing to kill and die on your behalf? How is a candidate tested if he brings back up on his rite of passage? Not every Krogan can be the strongest warrior, but each must inspire his peers to battle at his side. If the ones who know you best can find nothing worthy in you, you should wander the wastes and die alone. Before you weaken my clan. Grunt will strengthen Clan Erdnot. Name our target, and it will die. Spoken well. Most aliens, and some Krogan, do not understand our ways. I believe this human does. Aliens don't know strength. My followers are true Krogan. Everything about Grunt is a lie. <laughs> 
<laughs> you, you dare. <laughs> I like this human. He understands. I withdraw my denial. This will be decided elsewhere. <laughs> you have provoked them. Reason enough for me to like you. They're your problem now. Do we need any special equipment? To begin the right, only the candidate and his crant are required. You love battle, don't you, Shepard? The last gasp of a dying opponent. Bring your love of the fight to Grunt's trial, and he will succeed. Is that Krogan gonna be a problem? He is forbidden to interfere, will he? During the rite of passage, you must be ready for anything, Shepard. From what you've shown me, you will not disappoint. We've waited long enough. Tell us how this works. Still your impatience, Shepard. For now, know that Grunt will be tested and that you must adapt. We're ready. Let's do this. Excellent. I love that interaction. One of my favorites. Uh, we'll stick with uh, Morden. This is Tachanka's most recent scar. The last surface city to fall in the rebellions. The keystone was at the heart. It has survived wars and the passage of centuries. It endures, like the Krogan. If you wish to join Clan Erdnot, you must contemplate the keystone and its trials. What will happen? Who knows? You must adapt. You must thrive no matter the situation. Any true Krogan will. All right, then. First, the Krogan conquered Tuchanka and mastered a natural world only we are fit to hold. Hold on. All right, now I'm ready. Come down. We play now. I'll put them down. Worthless. Killed that one. Killed that one. Beasts will know I'm worthy. Who's next? I, I was standing down with. <laughs> Come on, Varen. Who's next? Next. Not difficult. Next. 
Alright. That's the first wave done. Oh, we're getting there. Anyone else? Come on. Just under four minutes to go. Shit. 
Yes! We have company. Good. I want more. <laughs> You brought down the Thresher Maw. No one has done that in generations. Word not Rex was the last. My cramp gave me strength beyond my genes, which are damn good. This will cause discussion. I wonder. You say you are pure. No alien meddling in your construction. Just the Warlord of Tyr. Come on, Uvink. You want to try killing him? Give it your best shot. Not yet. This deserves consideration. Why? I'm not getting any more natural. You are powerful. <laughs> you are a mistake. But your potential could tip the current balance of the clans. You spit on my father's name. On Shepard's name. But now you stop ranting because I'm strong. With restrictions. You could not breed, of course, or serve on an alien ship, but you'd be clan in name. It's your choice, Grunt. Sounds like an easy job. That's the problem. I'm pure Krogan. Uvik, you were the pretender. Your head is valuable, whether you're alive or dead. Just try to take it. <laughs> We've been spotted. By a real Kurgan charging. That was easy. Uvik is meat. Let's signal at the keystone to get out of here and leave him to rot. Nice. Battlemaster, damn right. You have passed the rite of passage, earning the honor of clan and name. Many survive, but it has been years since a thresher maw fell. Your names shall live in glory. Run, you are Erdnacht. We now own property. Join the army and apply to serve under a battlemaster. Shepard is my battle master. He has no match. Understood. <laughs> Congratulations, Erdnot Grunt. Accept this token from Fortak. His weapons are the finest we have. What were you called before you became shaman? I gave up my name when I became the shaman. I am a conduit for the rage and bloodlust of my people. It would be wrong to retain my old identity. My life belongs to the clan. I want to know about Tchanka's past. Tchanka is a place of great gifts. It kills the weak, torments the slow, and destroys the stupid. Survival is an honor, and here, Krogan thrive. We cover this planet with our civilization, only to burn it to the ground a dozen times over. Each time, we grow stronger. When we are wise and powerful enough, we will tame the planet forever. I've never heard anyone say that wiping out their own civilization was a good thing. 
I'd have thought you of all aliens would understand, Shepard. The Krogan empires and clans of the past were glorious, built in great battles and conquests, but their cores were weak. How else could they have fallen? When Krogan civilization achieves its apex, there will be no stopping it. No stopping us. Tell me about Krogan rites and ceremonies. You have seen the rite of passage. Krogan suffer the rite of life at birth, and the rite of honor when they wish to be considered for breeding. The rite of firsts is suffered before a Krogan faces a new enemy. A clan leader also undergoes many rites in service to the clan. What rites did you go through to become Chief Shaman? Becoming the Shaman is excruciating. I passed through rites that made me wish to die. I carry the scars on my soul. I must perform rites each dawn and dusk to keep me bound into our Krogan nature. Our spirit is one of violence and death. I must be attuned to that. Your job is awful. Indeed. <laughs> I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. This should come in handy. Nice. Alright. That is Grunt's mission done. You got anything new to say? You again. What can Clan Knockmore do for you? I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. Alright, nothing new there. Alright. You don't have a place. Do you hear that a tank run in the human killed a pressure ball? Everybody's hurt. Hasn't been done since Rex himself. Alright, Morden, let's go get your loyalty mission done. Oh, I haven't spoken to you, have I? What do you want, human? Rex told me to be polite. He didn't say you were going to talk to me. I'm looking for a Solarian. The Blood Pack captured him and he was last seen around here. I heard about that Solarian. Poor bastard. If it's Blood Pack, then Clan Warlock has him. Sent one of my scouts to check it out, but he never reported back. Guess they got him, too. Chief told me to give you one of the trucks. Just follow the highway to Warlock's base if you've got the quads to deal with him in the Blood Pack. What can you tell me about Clan Warlock's base? Last I heard, the clan was holed up in an old hospital. I haven't seen it, though. I've only seen Clan Warlock from a distance. If I'd gotten closer, I'd have taken a shot. You get inside, though, bring a big gun. Warlock's base is crawling with blood pack. That doesn't sound too defensible. Why'd they hole up there? Any hospital on Tachanka has to be built well enough to withstand a bunch of enraged Krogan. When an injury forces us to switch over to secondary organs, things get messy. Higher thought processes don't always transition properly. Blood rage, they call it. Hmm. Any idea what they're doing with the Solarian? I assume they wanted to torture him. You don't take somebody home just to kill them. It's messy. Maybe he pissed off the blood pack, and they brought him here for special treatment. No skin off my hump what they do with him. One less alien on Tachanka. You don't seem to have much love lost for aliens. Don't get your quads in a twist. If I was gonna kill you, you'd know it. Rex believes we need to unite the Krogan people. I don't think we can do that with off-worlders interfering, but it's not my call. What's Clan Warlock's reputation, and how are they involved with the Blood Pack? Tough humps, and they're not friendly like we are. You ever run into the Blood Pack? Mercenary gang. Clan Warlock started it, one of the only gangs with an off-world presence. They're fanatics. Totally devoted to Warlock Gold. Whatever they did with your Solarian, Gold's behind it. What makes Gold so special? He's got two children. One of them is a girl. Some people think he's got a destiny. Not me. I had a cousin who won 20 consecutive games of Quasar. Lucky bastard. I'd ask my cousin for a loan, but I wouldn't swear allegiance to him. Luck. That's all it is. Same for Gold. But the Blood Pack has non-Krogan members, like Vorchev. 
<laughs> the Vorcha. They're just like the Varen. Only they can use guns and don't crap on the floor as often. The Krogan are the only real members of the Blood Pack. Anyone else is just there to soak enemy fire. All right. Oh shit. I meant to talk to the mechanic. Ah, never mind, that'll be fine. Ah yeah, we'll stick with Grunt, I think. Might as well wrap up Tachanka with the uh, with these two. Alright, here we are. Keep out an eye for an upturned truck, which I think is near the entrance to the hospital. Nothing there. Nice try. Give me that. Thank you. Anyone else? Ah, Varen. Headed for combat. Feel the blood rage. All right, I did not ask you to do that. I want you to reload. Do you have the thing I'm looking for? No. Yeah, uh, if you talk to the mechanic before you come on this mission, he tells you he needs uh, a manifold for a car he's working on. Whoa! Hopefully I can still pick it up and just take it to him afterwards. Not difficult. 
get them all. All right, here we go. We'll take that and give it to the mechanic. Uh, bypass. There we go. Repurposed Krogan Hospital. Sturdy, built to withstand punishment. Dead human body. That body, human. Need to take a look. Sores, tumors, ligatures showing restraint at wrists and ankles. Track marks for repeated injection sites. Test subject. Victim of experimentation. I don't suppose there's a way to tell who this poor bastard was? No tattoos or ID. Maybe slave or prisoner. Maybe merc or pirate. Irrelevant now. Clearly part of Krogan tests to cure genophage. Humans useful as test subjects. Genetically diverse. Enables exploration of treatment modalities. Wouldn't something native to Tachanka work better? Baron, maybe? Yes. Human experiments strictly high-level, concept testing. Native to Chanka fauna likely used later in development stages. Wise to delay use of Varen until necessary. Powerful bite. What can you tell about their experiments from looking at the body? Position of tumors suggests deliberate mutation of adrenal pineal glands, modifying hormone levels, counterattack on glands hit by genophage. Clever. Do you think they're close to curing the genophage? Can't say. Need more data. Conceptually sound, though. Genophage alters hormone levels, could repair damage with hormonal counterattack. How are humans more genetically diverse? More variable. Peaks and valleys, mutations, adaptations, far beyond other life. Makes humans useful test subjects. Larger reactions to smaller stimuli. I know we can look much different from each other, but Asari have a wide range of skin tones. No, ignore superficial appearance, down to genetic code. Biotic abilities, intelligence levels. Can look at random Asari, Krogan, make reasonable guess. Humans, too variable to judge. Outliers in all species, of course. Geniuses, idiots, but human probability curve offers greater overall variety. Fair enough. Experimenting on humans? That kind of crap is what makes Cerberus start to seem like a good idea. Never used humans myself. Disgusting, unethical, sloppy. Used by brute force researchers, not thinkers. No place in proper science. Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. I imagine you had to do some live subject testing while developing the new genophage. No, unnecessary. Limited tests to simulations, corpses, clone tissue samples. High-level tests on Varen. No tests on species with members capable of calculus. Simple rule. Never broke it. <laughs> now we've got two reasons to shut this place down. Focus on Malin. Too late to help the dead. Tree. We've got uh, a scout to find as well, so better keep an eye out for him. I am the speaker for Clan Werelock, Offworlders. You have shed our blood. By rights, you should be dead already. But Werelock Gold, the Chief of Chiefs, has ordered that you be given leave to flee and spread the message of our coming. Krogan don't generally let people go. What does Clan Werelock have planned? If you walk away now, you can tell your children that you saw Clan Werelock before our blood pack conquered the stars. You think the Erd not impressive? They are pitiful! Werelock Gold will destroy them! The Salarian will cure the Genophage, and Clan Werelock will spread across the galaxy in a sea of blood! Appears they discovered Malin's work. Unfortunate. It doesn't have to happen like this. I can understand wanting to cure the genophage. No human, you understand nothing! You have not seen the piles of children that never lived. The Krogan were wronged. We will make it right, and then we will have our revenge! Half the galaxy sees the Krogan as victims. If you start a war, you'll lose their support. We have the blood pack. And we have the Salarian. When our clan numbers in the millions, 
We will not need support. When we cure the genophage, Warlock Gold will rule all Krogan. The Krogan rebellions will become... You talk too much. See? The human cannot hit a simple target. <laughs> Some renegade options are just too you just can't resist them. Too late. Now you're dead. I'm a veteran. Uh, I'll put them down. There we go. Yeah, there are some renegade options in, in, in this game that you just can't say no to, and that was one of them. Alright, I think we're good. Yeah, I'll definitely have that. Labs likely through there. Can smell antiseptic, hint of dead flesh. Just get us there. Oh, yeah. Active console may contain useful data. One moment. Genetic sequences, hormone mutagens still steady. Protein chains, live tissue, clone tissue. Very thorough. Standard treatment vectors. Avoiding scorched earth immunosuppressants to alter hormone levels. Good. Hate to see that. Most people wouldn't be so casual about developing a sterility plague, Morden. Not developing, modifying, much more difficult, working within confines of existing genophage a hundred times the complexity. Errors unacceptable, could cause total sterility, malignant tumors, could even reduce effectiveness, worse than doing nothing. Had to keep Krogan population stable, one in 1,000. Perfect target, optimal growth, like gardening. You're saying you were working just as hard to keep their population from falling? Yes, could have eradicated Krogan. Not difficult. Increased mutation to degrade genetic structure further. Chose not to. Rachni extinction tragic. Didn't want to repeat. All life precious. Universe demands diversity. What was it like working on the genophage modification project? Best years of my life. Wake up with ideas, talk over breakfast, experiments all morning. Statistical analysis in afternoon, run new simulations during dinner, set data runs to cook overnight. Laughter, ego, argument, passion, galaxy's biggest problem, massive resources thrown at us, got anything we wanted. Do you keep in touch with your old team members? No, all changed with deployment. Made test drop on isolated Krogan clan, hit rest of Tuchanka when results were positive. End of project, separate ways. Watching it end, watching birth rates drop. Personal, private. Not appropriate for team. How can you agree with using the genophage, Morden? Look at what happened to Tuchanka as a result. State of Tuchanka not due to genophage. Nuclear winter caused by Krogan before Salarians made first contact. Krogan choices. Refuse truce during Krogan rebellions. Expand after Rachni wars. Splinter after genophage. Genophage medical, not nuclear. No craters from virus. Damage caused by Krogan, not Salarians, not me. So if the Krogan banded together and formed a united government, you'd welcome that? Yes. United Krogan saved galaxy, destroyed Rachni. Genophage not punishment, simply alters fertility to correct for removal from hostile environment. We're not going to find Malin staring at consoles. Come on. Dead 
broken. Female. Tumors indicate experimentation. No restraint marks. Volunteer. Sterile, Werelock female willing to risk procedures. Hoped for cure. Pointless. Pointless waste of life. I didn't expect you to be disturbed by the sight of a dead Krogan. What? Why? Because of Genophage work? Irrelevant. No. Causative. Never experimented on live Krogan. Never killed with medicine. Her death, not my work. Only reaction to it. Goal was to stabilize population. Never wanted this. Can see it logically. But still unnecessary. Foolish. Waste of life. Hate to see it. I didn't think you'd had much direct contact with things like this. Did you come to Tachanka after dropping your plague? Yearly recon missions. Water, tissue samples. Ensure no mistakes. Superiors offered to carry it on. Refused. Need to see it in person. Need to look. Need to see. Accept it as necessary. See small picture. Remind myself why I run a clinic on Omega. Rest, young mother. Find your gods. Find someplace better. I didn't expect spirituality from you, Morden. Genophage modification project altered millions of lives, then saw results. Ego, humility, juxtaposition, frailty of life, size of universe. Explored religions after work completed. Different races, no answers. Many questions. Sounds like you were trying to deal with your guilty conscience. The doctor who killed millions. Modified Genophage project great in scope. Scientifically brilliant, but ethically difficult. Krogan reaction visceral, tragic. Not guilty, but responsible. Trained as doctor, Genophage affects fertility, doesn't kill. Still, caused this. Hard to see big picture behind pile of corpses. Can you really just rationalize it all away? How do you justify it? Wheel of life. Popular Salarian concept. Similar to human Hinduism in focus on reincarnation. Appealing to see life as endless. Fix mistakes in next life. Learn. Adapt. Improve. Refuse to believe life ends here. Too wasteful. Have more to offer. Mistakes to fix. Cannot end here. Could do so much more. If you need this much soul searching to get over it, maybe the genophage was wrong. Had to be done. Brachni wars, Krogan rebellions, all pointed to Krogan aggression. So many simulations. Effects of Krogan population increase, all pointed to war. Extinction. Genophage or genocide. Save Galaxy from Krogan. Save Krogan from Galaxy. You could have cured the Genophage instead. Brought hope to the Krogan. They'd have rejoiced. Assumes human reaction. Krogan stimulus response different. Harsh environment. Take chance to fight. Flee. Would have caused chaos on Tuchanka. Victor would have war economy. Bloodthirsty army. Galactic expansion only logical outcome. More war. Genophage saved lives. War would have ended. So you're willing to sterilize a species based on the evidence of a few simulations? Yes. Millions of data points. Years of arguments. Countless scenarios. All noted Krogan fragmentation as dangerous. No unified culture to support repopulation. Would have been war. Turians and humans destroying Krogan utterly. Xenophage was better. Saved lives. Look at the dead woman, Morton. It doesn't look like you saved her. No, it doesn't. Worked with available data. Only option. No other possible. Doesn't matter. Ooh, this one gets heavy. Alright. That one. This is valuable. I think we're done here. Ah, here we go. The other, uh, the other scout is in here. Alright, let's. I appreciate that one being that easy. Thank you. You killed the Blood Pack guards. Not Blood Pack. Not member of Clan Werelock. Wrong clan markings. I'm a nerd, not scout. Werelock guards got me. Brought me here. 
The chief scout told us to watch for you. We've taken out the guards. Get back to Erdna. I can't. The Warlock did things to me. Drugs. Injections. Said I was sacrificing for the good of all Krogan. Experiments to cure the genophage. Everything's blurry. Hard to think. I have to stay. Morton, can you get him back on his feet? Stims, maybe? Something to bolster his immune system? You don't understand. I'm not too sick to leave. I have to stay. They're curing the genophage. They're gonna make it all better. They have to keep doing the tests. Caution, Shepard. Patient unstable, susceptible, brainwashed. Why do you want them to keep doing the tests? This is my fault. I got caught. Wasn't strong enough. Not good enough. This is the best I can do. This is all I can do. I'm not big enough to have a real shot with the females. I'll never have kids of my own. But if I help undo the genophage, then I mattered. Millions of children will be born. Warlock children. They're going to destroy the other clans. But... No. No, they said I was helping Erdnacht. If you want to help Erdnacht, you need to get back there. But it would take a real badass to make it back to camp while injured. I can do it. You? I said a badass, not some scout whining like a quarian with a tummy ache. I can do it. <laughs> I'm up. And I'm going to the female camp. Damn right you are. Get back there and show them what you're worth. Go. Go. <laughs> Nicely done. Fortunately, subject is unlikely to be contagious. <laughs> Yeah, the time to mention that would have been before. Crates ahead that are holding unstable materials. A misplaced shot could cause a significant explosion. Or a well-placed shot. Explosives useful. Burn through Krogan armor. Hostiles! There we go. Nicely done. There is something here. Grab that. Thank you. You right there, Grunt? go perfect grab that nothing in here all right then all right, I think we might just get this finished within the hour headed for combat Not, not anymore.
Hey, none of that, you. Hold the line, indeed. Ah, well, gold himself. Deploying incineration tech. And just like that, he's gone. Oh, excuse me. Right, what have you got for me? Perfect. Oh, Warden. That one and that one, perfect. This should come in handy. I've got plenty of stuff to try that I need to upgrade when we get back to the Normandy. Mainland, alive, unharmed. No signs of restraint, no evidence of torture. Don't understand. For such a smart man, Professor, you always had trouble seeing evidence that disagreed with your preconceptions. How long will it take you to admit that I'm here because I wish to be here? He wasn't kidnapped. He came here voluntarily to cure the genophage. Impossible. Whole team agreed. Project necessary. How was I supposed to disagree with the great Dr. Solis? I was your student. I looked up to you. Experiments performed here. Live subjects, prisoners, torture and executions. You're doing? We've already got the blood of millions on our hands, Doctor. It takes a bit more to put things right. I can deal with that. You honestly think the experiments you did here are justified? We committed cultural genocide. Nothing I do will ever be justified. The experiments are monstrous because I was taught to be a monster. Morton, did you ever perform experiments like this? No, never taught you this, Malin. So your hands are clean. What does it matter if the ground is stained with the blood of millions? You taught me that the end justified the means. I will undo what we did, Professor. The only way I know how. What happens if the genophage is cured and the Krogan expand again? That'll be on your head. We justified this atrocity by saying the Krogan would cause havoc and war if their population recovered. But look at the galaxy. Batarian attacks in the Traverse. Geth attacks in the Citadel. Is this a more peaceful universe? The assault on your Eden Prime might never have happened if we had let the Krogan recover. We'll never know. How would a Krogan population explosion have done anything to stop Saren and the Geth? An increased Krogan population would have forced the Council to take steps, likely involving colony rights in the Traverse. The Turian fleets would be vigilant for any military activity in the area. They might have stopped the Geth at Eden Prime. Supposition. Impossible to be certain. Don't you see? We tried to play God, and we failed. We only made things worse, and I'm going to fix it. You talked about killing, but the genophage isn't lethal. It only affects fertility rates. Krogan fight over fertile females. They become mercenaries or pirates because they see no alternative. They would be thriving in a cultural renaissance now had we not decided that this is what they deserved. Inaccurate. The Krogan population resulted in war. Simulations were clear. Why work with Clan Warelock? And how did you access the Genophage data? The data was easy to obtain. We all still had clearance. We were heroes. All I had to do was ask. As for the Warelock, they were the only clan with both the resources and the commitment. Erdnot has a larger camp than Warelock. Why not use them? Erdnot Rex is too soft. He wasn't willing to do the experiments I needed. It's Erdnot's loss and Warelock's gain. Their clan will be the first to recover from the crime we committed. Malin clearly doesn't need rescuing. What do you want to do? Have to end this. You 
can't face the truth, can you? Can't admit that your brilliant mind led you to commit an atrocity! <laughs> Unacceptable experiments. Unacceptable goals. Won't change. No choice. Have to kill you. Wait. You don't need to do this, Morton. You're not a murderer. No, not a murderer. Thank you, Shepard. Finished, Malin. Get out. No warlock left. Project over. What if he talks to Mork Rogan? Tells the public about the modified Genophage project? Special tasks group good at covering tracks. No proof. Warlock willingness to work with Salarian, unusual. Other Krogan will kill him. Aren't you worried that he'll start his research again? No. Locking this unit. Special task group can cut access to old data. Could start from scratch. Decades of work, though. Didn't teach you everything I knew. <laughs> you heard the professor. Get out before he changes his mind. Where am I supposed to go, professor? Don't care. Try Omega. Can always use another clinic. The Krogan didn't deserve what we did to them, professor. The genophage needs to end. Not like this. Apologies, commander. Misunderstood mission parameters. No kidnapping. My mistake. Thank you. Don't worry about me, Morton. How are you doing? Should have killed him. Wanted to. Easier than listening. Easier for him, too. Experiments indicate how far he's fallen. Expected it from Krogan. Not one of mine. Maybe you'll remember that the next time you're discussing the ethics of the genophage. Yes. So many variables. Stress responses. Impossible to truly predict. Something to think about. Malin's research, only loose end. Could destroy it. Closure, security. Still valuable, though. This is the research that included tests on living victims. It's tainted. Right now, victims died for nothing. Keep it, use it. Death's worth something. Malin's work could cure Genophage. Don't know. Effects on Krogan. Effects on Galaxy. Too many variables. Too many variables. You regret what the Krogan have become. You see the horror of what they did here, but you see the loss, too. Wasted potential. They don't deserve this, Morton. Save the data. Point taken, Shepard. Capturing data. Wiping local copy. Still years away from cure, but closer than starting from scratch. Done. Ready to go. Ready to be off to Chanka. Anywhere else. Maybe somewhere sunny. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Yay! The cure. All right. Before we head off. Go to the clan leader. Or not grunt. You go where you want. As we're here, let's tidy up some loose ends. We'll go talk to this mechanic. Give him the manifold. Step back. You killed that. Welcome to the clan, or not grunt. Honored to be a part of it. Good for you. Now go find something else to do. Those fools brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the field. You tell me, how can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? I've never seen a Krogan mechanic before. What? You think we kidnap Quarians and make them do the hard work? Not anymore, we don't. I found a combustion manifold out in the field. Is this what you need? That'll work. Faster than building one from scratch, at least. You just saved me three days' work, human. You've earned my time if you want it. 
What's that you're working on there? I'm tuning up these machines for battle. It's a wonder this Tomka here made it back to camp. It could be worse. A couple more hits on the broadside, and this thing would have crumbled. Krogan placed so much importance on martial strength. How did you become a mechanic? How do you think those fools make it to the field to kill each other? Who do you think keeps the weapons working? Without me, there's no battle, just slaughter. I am the military might of Clan Erdnaught. How do you feel about what Rex is trying to do? The old man's crazy if you ask me, which you just did. But that stuff fixes itself. If it doesn't work, Rex gets torn to shreds and we find out who's got the next best plan. Excellent stuff. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. <laughs> One wrong step, Shepard. Chat up. Alright, let's go have a final chat with Rex. And then we are done on Chichunka. Hey, Rex. You just can't help making trouble. No one has killed a maw since my turn in the right. Next, you'll tell me he's a Quint and craps dark matter. Guess that's what it takes to replace me. You are Erdnot Grunt. Welcome. Uh, we've already done all that. Good to see you, Rex. Sure you can't come with us? Wish I could. But I need to keep these short-sighted fools in line. Hunt well, Shepard. Alright. Chunko is now done. We've got Grunt and Re uh, Morden's loyalties. And we've got the beginnings of the cure for the genophage. Definitely going to need that in Mass Effect 3. All right, let's head back to the Normandy. <sighs> Round off this episode by chatting to Grunt and Morden, I think. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Lovely stuff. What have we got? Grunt's Commander, Shaman Erdnot. Damn it, I hate these things, but you need to hear this. You're part of Grunt's Krant and you're his leader, so keep him alive. Here I have to stay polite, play the role, but our people are dying. Krogan have always valued survival over tradition. If we're going to survive as a people, we need your vat grown Grunt. O'Kear was a madman, but he was a madman with a plan, and that's more than most, of, than most have on this ball of rock. So bring him back from your damn mission. My people need him, and if you get killed, I'll piss on your graves. <laughs> what a charming man. Alright. Let's get some upgrades out the way. Definitely need to build up the armor. Got plenty of resources to spend, so I might as well spend them. Uh, don't have that yet. Fair enough. God, no wonder the assault rifle's weak. That already still hard to believe Malin betrayed me betrayed my work disgusted by his actions proud of his nerve though almost thought he lacked backbone hope he finds something new better goal better purpose fewer torture tests you're really at peace with what happened yes of course 
can't change what happened. Life continues. Back to mission, back to work. Become like Malin otherwise. Salarian emotional processing faster than other species. Has to be. Short-lived culture can't spend time reminiscing. So you really don't feel bad at all about what happened on Tachanka? Yes, correct. Now at least. Greatly distressed at the time. Stages of grief, loss, anger, rationalization. Dealt with it. Most issues settled on Tuchanka, some on shuttle back to Normandy. Malin didn't seem like he processed his emotional response. He was obsessed with the genophage. True. Didn't mean to imply that Salarians were healthier emotionally. Can still make wrong choices, bad decisions from grief, anger, guilt. Malin couldn't accept feelings. Made decision. Executed. Probably before I left for Omega. Wish I'd seen it. Salarians still feel, just resolve it quickly. Explains lack of marriage, can't sustain courtship emotions. Or perhaps based on reproduction. Unsure. <laughs> what about Malin's data on the genophage? His attempts at a cure? What about it? Have it over there somewhere. Not dealing with it now. Need to focus on collectors. Not important now, regardless. Appreciate you helping me back on Tujanka. Should get back to work. Wasted enough time already. Lots to do. Talk later. Oh, wish I could deal with emotional issues as quickly as Morden can. Alright, uh, let's go check in on Grunt, see how he's doing. Heard not Grunt. I like it. I have a clan. That makes me... It makes me want to fight, not just able to. And Uvink, I wanted to disembowel him, to tear out his spine like a trophy. Can you focus that on our real enemy? Or do I have to lock you up for the ship's safety? I get it now. It's part of what I am. It was just delayed because of being tank bred. Now that I know it's not an outside thing, and I have a place as a Krogan, I like it. Our enemies are in trouble, Shepard, and we better not run out of targets. There's no danger of that. They're practically lining up. Everyone gets a turn. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't want it any other way. Excellent. Everyone's happy. Well, not quite everyone. But we're getting through these loyalty missions, so that's something at least. But for now. I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.